This uh, model review is of the X1, the Bell X1. It is by Edward, and it's 148 scale. And um, this is the Profi Pack edition. 148 scale, uh, the X1 is actually quite hard to find of just the standard X1. Uh, this is obviously the first plane that flew faster than the speed of sound. Um, and there's some different options of how to paint them. Uh, my preference is going to be to to, uh, to do as, as the uh, initial plane that went fast in the speed of sound. And I bought this model online. And it's been uh, started. Some weights have been added to the uh, to the front here. This uh, has a fair level of detail actually. This is an Edward, so you expect uh, this level of detail these are recessed panel lines, they've got some uh, riveting areas on the other side also some added uh, weights looks like the uh, cockpit has started being built here the uh, tail wings let's have a look here these are the wings, fairly well made, no flashing, molds are really well aligned. Some of the details for the wheels, here's the instrument panel, it was a very simple plane. Here's the uh, cockpit, uh, which has been built already. relatively simple cockpit as there weren't a lot of features for this plane. Here's the uh, instruction guide and uh, gives you some of the details about the uh, X1. Some of the different parts here so they tell you not to use the parts in blue uh, because there are actually are resin parts that come along and uh, we'll have a look at that. It also has the mask to paint the uh, uh, canopy and some photo etch details depending on which version you want to build. Instructions on how to build the uh, cockpit. This has already been started. And uh, how to paint that. Put together your fuselage. And the wings. It's a very simple model actually. Not a huge amount of parts. Um, some of the photo etch parts uh, to build for your uh, instrument panel. And then the, uh, the wheels. Now you could uh, have this hatch left open if you wanted to, um, but I prefer to um, have it closed. So this is option A, and, um, and there's option B, option C, and option D. I think I want to go for the original as I wanted to have it as the, um, the plane that first flew faster than the speed of sound. Let's have a look here. So here are our parts as with the resin parts. These are very well made. Obviously these are by um, Edward. They make some very high quality Parts. They've included. They've included the uh, brakes, but you can see here some of the etching. Very high quality parts. I actually like the way that they have made the join right where it's going to sit on the ground, so you wouldn't necessarily need to have the uh, tire marks there. And then there's the front one as well. Here is our canopy. And that definitely uh, will be easier to paint when you use this, which is the mask. You would lay it on top and then peel it off. These are the uh, photo etched parts. 
and uh, let's have a look at those. You can see here there are some seat belts as well as the instrument panel and the instrument panels come in two uh, parts. Uh, one is the actual instruments behind and then the covers and then for the side panel let's have a look at the uh, decals here. decals that go on this model and um, Glamorous Glynis that was the name of the original but this is a very well made model uh, typical by Edward lots of detail lots of accessories uh, including some photo etch parts very nice decals we have some resin parts we have a paint mask uh, and then the, just the overall quality of the model is exceptional. Recessed panel lines, no flashing, rivet lines, uh, tremendous detail. So this is going to be a very nice model to build.